There have been a number of significant developments overnight in this investigation and manhunt. At approximately 8 p.m. last evening, a motorist reported seeing a male crouched near the wood line along the south side of Fairview Road, west of Route 100. The motorist turned her vehicle around in an effort to verify what she saw. As she drove back past, the individual was gone. We had a large number of troopers already in the area and utilized them to form a perimeter around that area. A Border Patrol tactical team was also in the immediate vicinity and went directly to the location of the sighting. They observed footprints in some mud which were identical to the prison shoes worn by Cavalcante. A track was initiated and shortly thereafter both of his prison shoes were located. Information was received from another resident in, the, in that immediate area that a pair of work boots had been stolen from a porch at her residence. The tracking of Cavalcante continued in a northerly direction and at 10.10 p.m. a call was received from a resident on Coventryville Road indicating a short Hispanic male, no shirt and wearing dark pants, had entered his garage while the homeowner was in it and that he grabbed a 22 rifle that was leaning in the corner of the garage. The homeowner drew a pistol and fired at Cavalcante as he fled with the rifle. PSP responded and secured that scene. At that time, a green sweatshirt and white t-shirt believed to belong to Cavalcante were discovered near the edge of the driveway. The perimeter was expanded to include that area. Overnight, searches of the area within the perimeter were conducted by tactical teams from multiple agencies, teams from Pennsylvania State Police, Border Patrol, ATF, FBI, U.S. Marshals, and Chester County have been active through the night. Teams are currently being rotated out and replaced with fresh teams. Aviation assets, canines, mounted patrols, and numerous other assets have been mobilized and are currently operating in this search area. Upwards of 500 law enforcement officers are engaged in securing the perimeter and in conducting the searches. We are mobilizing additional resources as we speak and are planning for an extended operating period if necessary. Cavalcante is considered armed and extremely dangerous.